Are you tired of your 9 to 5 job? You honestly feel like there's no sense of purpose, like there's no purpose in life. You honestly tried everything. You tried drinking coffee, you tried going out on a run in the morning, in the evening, you probably also tried yoga. Then, here's a good news for you. Miracle Mentality, every morning, a devotion just made for you with Pastor Jolly George so that you can have some sense of purpose in life, just like me. Praise the Lord and good morning. Uh, let us read from Psalm 91 and verse 1 to 3. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I'll say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress. My God, in Him will I trust. Surely he shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowler and from the noisome pestilence. Hallelujah! Many times we ask the question, is it possible to lead a fearless life? Is it possible to lead a life in this dangerous world without fear? Is it possible to live in this world with the highest security in the midst of calamities and all uh, expected dangers in this world? Yes, it is possible. Only thing is if you dwell or if you abide in the presence of the Almighty God. That's what it says. He that dwelleth in the sacred place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. Because when you dwell under the shadow of the Almighty, He will become your refuge. He will become your fortress. And He will deliver you from all kinds of dangers, all kinds of attack of the evils. That's what no harm can come near to your dwellings. That, that promises will become reality once you dwell in the presence of the Almighty God. Hallelujah. So, and also, when the issues comes, when the challenges comes, He will help you to overcome that. Always, the, when the enemy's arrows come straight at you, even though you are dwelling in the presence of the, or in the, in the shadow of the Almighty God, it doesn't mean that the, the arrow of the devil doesn't point you. Definitely, He will point you. In fact, more of the arrows will be pointed at you. But he will cover you and He will give you strength. He will give you a protection, a security, so that it won't come and touch you. When the calamities comes like a tsunami, when the calamities comes like a big waves, He will make you a water walker. Because you are abiding or you are dwelling in the presence of God. You are in the under the shadow of the Almighty God. So today morning I want to encourage you by saying that if, if you have a problems like tsunami, you are facing the challenges like big waves or uh, the, the devil, the evil or the enemies, enemies arrows are pointed at you. Don't get discouraged. Don't get feared. Do not be afraid because you are dwelling in the presence of Almighty God. You are under the shadow of the Almighty God. Therefore, He is your refuge. He is your fortress. And he is your cover. Hallelujah. So he, His promises will come true in your life. The, it will become a reality in your life. And the reality is He promised that He will never leave you, neither forsake you. And now you are safe and secure and protected under the shadow of the Almighty God. So with this understanding, with this encouragement, with this confidence, face your day today and you will be a victorious person. Hallelujah! Shall we pray? Father, we thank you and we praise you for this wonderful morning you have given to us. Yes, Lord, thank you for the promise you have given to us, Lord. Lord, thank you. Thank you for covering us, giving security to us and protecting us, Lord. Yes, Lord, we will live fearlessly, Lord. We know that from every danger, every snare of the fowler, every every arrow of the enemies, Lord, you are there to protect us. You became our fortress. You became our refuge, Lord. Therefore, we thank you and we can face this day with the boldness, saying that the Lord is with me and I am staying under the shadow of the Almighty, Lord. We thank you and we praise you. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Amen. It is possible to live a life without fear. So, have a blessed day.